Hey guys, you're watching the EV screen. Be sure to support us by subscribing to us and those who are already subscribed, thank you so much for your support. Ford has been teasing its next generation of electric vehicles for some time and the speculation of regarding what the automaker could bring to the table persisted today as the automaker detailed its upcoming SUV as a personal bullet train, only giving the mind the eye full reign of what could be to come. Ford Investor Day shed light on several new projects and various details of the SUV company has been working on. CEO Jim Farley and Chief Officer of the EVs and Digital System Dog Fields both hyped up the new vehicle with several descriptions that, that certainly have enthusiasts wondering what could be to come. Farley and Field gave some hints as to what Ford could bring to the table. The pair said the new vehicle would be similar to Expedition in terms of size and would feature three rows of seating, but it would not replace the large SUV, which has been a crucial part of the company's lineup since it was introduced in 1997. It didn't make sense to phase out the Expedition completely it wouldn't have made for a very good EV and it wouldn't have made for a very good expedition. Field, who has worked for both Tesla and Apple, said the gas-powered expedition still has its place and will continue being built for those who have longer trips with towing or hauling things. Transitioning the expedition away from its traditional powertrain into an EV would require the company build a heavy, large and expensive battery that would make things inefficient and more expensive than needed. The new SUV will have its own look. It'll be longer, sleeker, quieter vehicle with amazing size and features of an interior space, Field said via Fox News. It's beautiful and unlike anything in the segment so far. It should have 350 miles of range and will likely feature a 100 kilowatt hour battery pack. This efficiency is much more attractive to those who are concerned about the sustainability and usefulness in comparison to other legacy built EVs. The Hummer EV from GMC, for example, features a 200 kWh battery pack, and while GM has struggled to keep up production of the vehicle, that's all for today. Thanks for watching the video. Have a great day.